Yo, what is good, YouTube? Welcome back to another JC2K video. In today's video, we're going to be opening up the free hidden gem diamond plus pack, or I guess it is a guaranteed diamond, but 92 plus pack that you can get from the Dunktober event this weekend here at NBA 2K25, my team. Before we hop into the video, if you haven't already, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Help me push towards the 40,000 subscriber mark on the channel. I upload every single day, tons of consistent daily my team content. We are out here grinding, man. Tons of content every single day, grinding out challenges, all that type of stuff. Stuff, getting y'all as much content as we can so we'd really appreciate it if y'all do subscribe and without further ado let's hop right into it so this really legitimately took me two domination games and one triple threat game that's it that's all it took for this this is an hour and 15 minute grind max like you could really get this done in an hour to be honest um very very easy quick grind in case you did not see the um excuse me in case you didn't see the free reward or the way to get this uh these are the challenges you got to complete you got to get 10 dunks of point guards 10 dunks of shooting guards 10 dunks of small forwards 10 dunks of power forwards 10 dunks of centers and then 50 points assists and rebounds just 50 of total not 50 of each with dukes of dunk players 50 of total as well uh with dunk tober players and then 500 points assists rebounds over multiple games which is the one that takes the longest the reason that you gotta take play two or three domination games um but really it's not a long grind it's not a hard grind this really did not take long at all this is even easier than the D Rose grind last week for a free 92 plus. Not too shabby at all. We've also got a couple of those Dunktober event packs that you can get this weekend, which are these packs right here. So um, I'm going to open those up real quickly in this video as well. We got a Dunktober Deluxe pack as well, by the way, for completing a couple of the Dunktober challenges, which, by the way, in case you didn't see those, those challenges are over here just down in Dunktober. Work the same as the Dukes of Dunk ones did, the Ironclad ones, the Barbecue Buckets, where you can get four Deluxe packs, one for completing each three challenges. So that's three total there and then one for completing the whole set of nine challenges so we're going to open up all those packs that i do have sitting in the pack market right here in this video and hopefully we're going to get a good hidden gem man because last week i got jack Marin out of the free one he is awesome it was a really really good pull here um hoping that this week we get ourselves another good one because uh i got chuck person out of my king of the court one he's not great i got vlade out of the king of the court week week before he's okay jamal crawford was the one that i got from the lou dort exchange a couple weeks ago and that's all the diamond hidden gems that i've gotten this year are those four it's the only one that I locked in was the Jamal Crawford. That's the only one that cost. And then Chuck and Vlade were free from King of the Court. Marin was free from last week's D-Rose agenda. So hoping for another good one in today's video. Just somebody who helps my team is what I'd love to see. Especially, would really love like an elite small forward. Like a truly elite small forward. Somebody like a Thurl Bailey or a Joe Smith or MPJ. Or somebody with some size and some versatility at the small forward power forward position. Paulo would be awesome. Would love one of those guys. But really, anybody who's good who can help my team would be a plus. Probably not really looking for a point guard to be honest because i already got oladipo and jamal crawford so don't really want one a really good center would be fine though because i'd be happy to take vlade out of the lineup if i get a really good big there's some good ones in here that we could definitely get and some duds as well so fingers crossed today is not the day where we get a dud uh, but let's open up these dunktober event packs real quickly first i have seen already on twitter that somebody pulled a diamond out of this so you can get good pulls although you can also get a badge a logo and another logo like i just did uh where it's basically nothing all this stuff though i will say does quick sell for mt if not sell on the auction house for mt like badges will sell on the auction house stuff like that there's gonna be you can make some decent mt from this for example there we go ruby gems the game desmond bane that's not a ton of mt because it's an unsellable card but hey an a ruby to lock in for gems of the game I and mean, you can get some decent pulls a ruby right there is not too bad and a basketball and a badge i guess we will take that let's open up this dunktober deluxe pack as well the odds are very low that we will get anything particularly good out of this but it is possible and it's gonna be an emerald seems like it's always an emerald with these challenges uh and we get d brown out of that one so nothing too crazy out of there although i guess the ruby gems of the game poll was cool that card really isn't gonna help my team or anything like that though this is the pack that we are all here to see let me know in the comment section down below who you get out of your diamond hidden gem uh, i like that this is an easy grind that it's accessible for everyone these are the types of grinds that we need on a weekly basis and have been getting for the past week but need to continue for the game to succeed and the game to thrive and this is the good this is good content i'm, I'm glad that they gave us some real good content this week i hope we get something else good next week maybe a good triple threat park win streak on sunday like we did last week as well that would be fire but a hidden gem 90 two plus overall pack let's get into it let's see who we can get all i want is somebody that helps my team that is what i am asking for no dud please i would love a good small forward power forward center shooting guard somebody like that i'm going to close my eyes once i see the stat and the team that they are on it is a western conference 95 drop out that's probably a guard what team are they on is that mpj 
Aaron Gordon, MPJ, who is this? Come on, give me somebody good, please. Alex English, you know what? I think that's good. I'm not gonna say that's a bad one. I am cool with a Nuggets small forward, Alex English. I think he's pretty good. Uh, that's a nice little team upgrade right there. I think he slots in somewhere. I, I don't know if I'm even gonna use this Chuck person because I low-key might use James Posey over him. Uh, I don't know. I think I'm probably gonna use Chuck person this weekend in King of the Court. But that's my new starting small forward, I think, honestly, is uh, this Alex English. He's what, six foot, six eight, so he's got pretty good size. 97 offense, 94 defense, 85 three ball, 98 driving layup, and 86 mid-range, 90 driving dunk, 90 ball handle, 85 steal, 84 perimeter, 84 interior, 90 perimeter. Wow, that's good too. Good speed, good agility, good vert, 82 strength. He's a good card. Wow, I like this card. Posterizer, dead eye, late mix master, physical finisher on Hoff, gold handles for days, unpluckable challenger, off ball pass, pick dodger, glove interceptor, a shifty shooter, lightning launch, on ball menace. Nice looking card here, honestly. Uh, now, he could use limitless, bailout, dimer, post lockdown, brick wall, immovable enforcer, set shot specialist, paint patrol. That's like eight badges. Um, I could only give him five. So he's going to be missing a couple of badges for sure. Like, I'm not going to be able to put Dimer on him. Not going to be able to put maybe Brick Wall, maybe Rebound Chaser. I don't know. We're going to have to skip a couple of badges on this card. But overall, he looks super solid. Like, I think this is a pretty good one. I am not too mad about Alex English as my free diamond. I think that's a good one. I was asking for somebody who helps my team, and Alex English helps my team. And I wanted a small forward. I got a small forward. I'd be lying if I'm sitting here and complaining about that, to be completely honest. I think Alex English is about as good as I could have gotten, to be honest. Um, let's see what his movement's like. I mean, his escape isn't great. Oh, that's Curry escape. No, that's good. Okay, so he's got Curry escape, too. That's, wow, this card's actually tough. And release is very, very good. I like this card. Okay, yeah. Let's go. Beautiful stuff. Normal fade, it looks like, as well. Um, I'm on rookie right now, so that's why that just went in. But normal fade... What's his drag back? Drag back's okay. What's his dribble style looking like? Um, can he do a, like a burst at all? Uh, it doesn't look like he can get any sort of real burst. So that's okay. Uh, what's the dribble style looking like? Let's just drag back and run out of it. Not very fast. He's not moving insanely well, but he's got curry escape, which is nice. Um, and so, I mean, at least there's that, right? Curry escape will be good for getting some crabs and the release itself is very, very nice. So overall, you know what? I'm pleased with Alex English. This is a good one. He's got a good release. He's a super solid, versatile defender. He's athletic. He's got good size at small forward at 6'8". This is a good card. He is my new best small forward. I am not complaining about Alex English whatsoever. That's a good pull today. Cannot, can't be mad about that one, to be honest. I am pretty pleased about um, Alex English, all things considered. He's a, he's a, ple he's a good one, man. I, that's a good, that's a good pull. I'm pretty pleased. I, I gotta, I gotta say. Like, I wanted a good card. He's really nice. His animations feel really nice. His release is butter. Defensively, he's a stud. That's a W. We will take it. Let me know in the comment section down below, like I said, who you get and or who you got. And hopefully you get somebody good like I did. If you did enjoy the video, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. I'll be back with more 2K content very, very soon. I appreciate y'all. Peace.